everybody, everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. So I am dumb and stayed in bed way too long this morning. It's now literally one o'clock in the afternoon and I have just been watching Keen and JC's The Reality House. I watched Love Island. I have watched, what did I watch on Netflix? What's it called? Oh my God, it's got Asa Butterfield in. Butterfield, what's it called? It's Sex Education, that's what I want about. I was watching Sex Education this morning because Haz and Freya were watching the like final episodes of, I don't know if it's the second or third season. They were watching the final episodes of the season that's just come out and I was in the kitchen watching it and I started watching Sex Education, the first series when it first came out. And I didn't like how Americanized it was, however they were British, it was really pissing me off. Um, but then I liked the last two episodes of the second one. So I've ruined a lot of the plot twist. I already know like a lot of the characters who are now like gay and stuff and it just ruined wins it all but I'm gonna watch it because I want something to watch. So I've literally woke up at half past ten this morning, accepted a parcel from ASOS which I'm gonna show you in a second. I've just unpackaged it. I'm like oh my god I'm gonna start my vlog and then I've just been laid in bed literally not even had breakfast or anything. I've just literally been laid in bed watching series as series after series, episode after episode all morning long and now I've got to get up. So <laughs> I'm up. Hi everyone. I'm not really doing much today. I have a bunch of editing to do. I've got to edit my main channel video for tomorrow. I've got to film my main channel video actually which is part of the ASOS order. I really want to get ahead with my schedule so if I film a video today and then another one on either Thursday or Friday I'm like a week in advance every time for my channel videos posting twice a week. So I'm gonna try and do it, I'm gonna try and stick to it. I've got the video ideas right now but whether or not they continue is another story because that's what always fucks me up. I think a video is gonna be good, film it, start editing it and I'm like alright this is shit, now I'm behind. I ordered some stuff from ASOS. I'd be wanting a black puffer jacket. I have this jacket right here which is the nicest like puffer jacket I've ever ever bought from ASOS. Such a nice material. It's like the same material as the Prada ones, or at least it feels like that. Super heavy duty. But it's really, really long, as you can see. And it's really cool, really cozy, like a big sleeping bag. But then I bought this one, which is literally just like a normal size bomber jacket. And I love this one so much more in terms of like the cut of it and the fit of it is so much nicer than this one, unless I'm wanting a long ass coat. So I went on ASOS yesterday, saw that the ASOS Y, ASOS design, I mean, do this exact puffer jacket get but in like a short version so I bought the shorter version and also I'm doing a little DIY video with some jeans so I bought some jeans because I was gonna go into Primark and buy some jeans for like seven eight pounds and I looked in there and I couldn't find a shade of denim that I liked which I, this sounds really dumb but I wanted this shade of denim in order to do what I want to do it had to be like this light shade and I went on ASOS and these were like 22 pounds with student discount it went down to like 18 so I was like you know what bargain love that I'm gonna try these on and show you what they look like I'm hoping these jeans fit. I don't know if I got the right size. Oh, these definitely don't fit. Oh, I'm so dumb. I do this every time. I don't know if this is just the fit of the jeans though, or if like, I'm just fucking stupid. I mean, for the purpose of what I need them for, they'll be fine. They're just not my usual type of jeans. Um, They're a nice colour. But like, I definitely got the wrong size. The length of them, like to where they sit on my feet. It's actually not that bad, but yeah, not my usual type of jeans. Would not normally pick these up. They're also not got much crotch room. Like I wear my jeans quite high, I've realized. I wear my jeans like this high, and then there's not much room to breathe in the, the penis area, but here we are anyway. Don't mind these actually. Probably gonna fuck them up by trying to do a DIY. Who is calling me? Sorry about that little um, delay, so I've just FaceTime me, but I am, um gonna try on this jacket now. I am most excited about this. I really, really hope it fits well, because it says it's oversized, but I don't want it to be too oversized. It doesn't fit like an actual bomber jacket or puffer jacket, whatever it's called. Um, so I will wait and see. I don't know about this. This is what the bomber jacket looks like. I wish it were more padded, like it's not as thick as I thought it were gonna be. I think that's why I was saying I don't know if I like it. It's super, super oversized and big. I'm imagining like a big hoodie underneath this, like this would be so fun with a big hoodie and stuff on. Um, I kind of do like the fit of it actually. I'm gonna tighten these a little bit more so it like sits more on my hips. But I think it's really, really cool. Good purchases there by me. I just wish this were more padded, like it's quite thin. I guess you can't always win. <laughs> Right everyone, I've had my breakfast, I'm all dressed and ready to go as you can see. New jacket, new jeans, not new shoes but I've not worn these in a while. And we're off to you now. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hands there. I haven't worn this hat in a while, but I thought I'd give it a go, you know, I'm sick of wearing beanies all the time. I really, really like this coat. The bag obviously stops it from being super puffy on one side, but I really, really like it. I'm gonna go to uni now, get shut down for all my ideas, come back and probably regret going. It is honestly such a nice day outside. It's really, really cold, but it's really nice. It's like bright. I don't mind it when it's cold and bright. I only hate it when it's like dull, cold, gloomy, and everyone's like, oh, but it's nice and sunny. The sun's really nice on all the buildings. So yeah, I really just know that 
that I'm going to get to uni and they're going to tell me everything I planned on doing is not going to be good enough for my final major and I'm just going to be there like because <laughs> right now obviously I'm not stressed because I have what I think is all my ideas ready and sorted oh my god that house is such a nice background for a fire out if only I had someone to take it for me yeah I'm just I just know I'm going to get shut down oh, yeah. Right, I'm back from uni. My one-to-one -one went really, really well, actually. I really like the woman that did my one-to-one, -one, so I'm hoping she's gonna be the woman that I'm speaking to throughout the duration of this project, because I kind of wanted to be my therapist, I'm not gonna lie, she's really, really good. Uh, we just had just a general chat, and then she sort of advised me what to do with my project. Not too sure what to actually do with my project, though. I made an advice would go walk and look at fashion shops. Fashion shops, go look in clothing shops. So, that was my advice. It sounds really dumb, but it made a lot of sense when she was actually saying it to me. And what she was saying, I really, really do appreciate. Um, I'm now going to go and get myself my chicken dippers and my garlic bread that I forgot I had. Also, I'm keeping my coat on because it's cold and this coat is so damn cozy. But um, I'm going to get my chicken dippers, my garlic bread. I don't know why it's so blue. Wait. There we are. Um, where did I put it? <laughs> where did I put my food? That's the main question. I can't actually remember. I think it's in the microwave. Right, I'm gonna sit here now and eat this lovely chicken strips. And where is it? Where's the thing? Oh, oh. What? I'm just scared about these ones. For, I'm still gonna eat it. I just rang my mum and asked it how I heat it up. My mum said, why are you heating it up? Just don't eat it. Ooh, that looks nice. Oh, it's upside down. Right, dinner time. I um, have finished eating up my little bit of food now. I didn't really eat many of the chicken dipper things because my- <laughs> Freya! You stupid <laughs> <sighs> Now my heart rate's beating. Oh, who is it? I'm talking shit about you. Oh, it's confessionals. Oh, Get oh, out. Yes. Get out! This is Love Island oh, Diary Room. Oh, who is it? I'm telling my vlog that I finished eating my food okay. and that I'm now going to film a main channel video. Bye! Have you not thought that maybe what you're saying is a bit pointless? I'm now finished my food and I'm going to film a main channel video. I think you're really, really boring. Anyway, I am now going to finish my food. I finished my food, I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. Now I'm nervous. Oh. Right, what I was saying is, I've set up my camera, I'm ready to film a video. I'm going to throw a bleach all over my jeans, all over my bedroom and hopefully on Freya. Oh fuck, that was quite violent. Never mind. It is such a long time later since I've actually picked up my camera and filmed it. Then I finished filming the video that I wanted to film today. I, in fact, I've not even finished it. I'm halfway through it. I basically started filming it, realised that I've got to let the bleach, because I'm bleaching some jeans, got to let the bleach sit for probably like 24 hours and then wash it off, wash the jeans and then dry the jeans and then actually finish the video. So technically it's going to be like a three day process. I got halfway through it. It took such a long time. I cut out stencils. I've been painting. It literally, it, well it's now 8 o'clock in the evening and I started filming this video at like 5 o'clock. In fact maybe earlier than that. Probably like 5 o'clock and um, now it's 8 o'clock so I've been doing it for like the past three hours. I've now changed into my pyjamas. I've just been sat in the kitchen with Freya and Haz. So they're watching you. I already watched it all. Instead of doing my dissertation last month I binged watched you over Christmas and um, I've already watched it. One on season two. So I'm gonna sit in the kitchen now and watch you with these guys. I'm uploading a main channel video. I've been editing it actually today uh, and I just finished up the last little bit so I'm uploading tomorrow's video, well, tomorrow for me, don't know when it will be for you. And I'm like, oh my god, I've not picked up my camera and vlogged. So I just thought I'd update you all what I'm doing with my life. Good morning everyone, it is now the next day. I literally spent the evening in bed last night watching Love Island and you. I watched it in the living room with Freya and then I went into bed and continued watching it. So I'm now up bright and early and I'm on my way to a breakfast meeting in Carnaby Street. I'm currently literally like 10 minutes away. Uh, I'm gonna meet my manager and just chat through some 2020 plans. Today's a really exciting day. I'm not gonna tell you exactly what I'm doing just because, yeah, I don't wanna ruin it. I always do like a little preview of it and I don't wanna obviously ruin it before I go in there. But I'm gonna go in there now, have my meeting and then meet has and then I've got uh, uh, actually got a facial today so that'll be interesting I've arrived in Selfridges to get my facial now we're just filling the consultation form I'm just waiting to have my shit done this is my skin before look how gross my nose is 
Let's see what it looks like after. So a little change of scenery since um, my facial, got it done. My skin's looking great. We're now at the Britain's Got Talent. So I haven't filmed anything because I've been so busy and rushed. But here we are. I'm also really tired. And the woman accidentally put something in my eye and now I look high. fucking camera always do this hi right i have literally been probably the worst vlogger ever today i mean step up from the last vlog but been the worst vlogger i'm now back home as you can see i've basically been in a rush all day that's why i've been finding it hard to pick up my camera i had obviously my facial earlier on which my skin feels great from however i've just got a lot of redness and also i said in the clip when i came out of the thing and was in britain's got talent that the woman accidentally put something in my eyes she didn't actually put dentally put something in my eyes i realized as i was saying it i opened my eyes midway through the treatment and the moisturizer or whatever it was went into my eyes and i can't tell if it's that that's made my eyes sore i don't know if you can see my eyes look super watery i don't know if it's that the cold from outside because I've been literally out all day long or the concealer I put on under my eyes after to go on Britain's Got Talent whenever I put any sort of concealer on it makes my eyes so sore so I don't know what it is but my eyes look like this and they're really like they're not burning but you know when you're super super tired and like you know you're tired because you've got tired eyes I just feel like I've got tired eyes basically I look stoned so that's always good sat on Britain's Got Talent front row like like this they also made me take my hat off so I sat like this actually more accurate I wanted to fucking die Hi. so what do I do? I, need to I look like hands. my brother. You pull it out. <gasps> All of it. Yeah. Ew, and then open it. Off? Finger pad. Put it on your finger. Ooh, put this on my winky. <laughs> Ew, that would burn. Which side does it go on? Whichever, they're both the same. Finger puppy. And then rub it all around your face. All the way around. Oh, I wouldn't put it by your eyes. Like citrus stuff in it's like lemon citrus. It does say avoid ice. You know it's all natural ingredients. Because you know I didn't ask. And then guess what? Don't wash it off. Oh uh, yeah. Um. I've already had a fucking tutorial. Well, why'd you ask me how to do it then? Silly can. Like wasting people's time to my speciality. Hi guys, my skin Hi guys, so today's video is sponsored by Dermatology. Dermatology card. Don't rub it in circular motions, you don't rub down. Oh my god, does she fucking work in clinic? Yeah. I don't think so with your acne prone behaviour. Uh, sorry, any acne I've got right now is this and it's a hormone spot. If you want to see Haz's skincare journey, make sure to check out her Instagram page where she does daily updates. I do. For 2,000 followers. It's actually 90k now. I'm joking. Can you believe it? You've 90k. No one asked. Hey, you've just what offended you your favourite YouTuber as well. You're trying to cause a scene. And I'm not having it. Can you believe this costs 70 pounds? Oh, yeah, huh? Oh, I don't know. How many people are you getting now? I can't believe they've got a brother and sister. Some people actually believe that's true, and that's crazy to me because we've actually kissed. <gasps> it's just... Jokes, we have a kiss, guys. Oh, it's still recording. I thought I'd stopped it. <laughs> How cheeky of me is this? Let's go and do a prank on Anastasia. Byron. Where's your dermological skincare routine? Don't see it. Um, uh, I don't know what that last clip actually was, you know, or that last segment of the vlog. It was a little bit, and a little bit, and a little bit in Anna's books. But yeah, I didn't actually end the vlog, so I do apologise. This is me now editing the vlog back, looking like a fisherman in this bucket hat. Hope you guys enjoyed. I, don't, I really don't know what it was. Like, I honestly, I'm just trying to pick up my camera more. We're really random, really all over the place. My skincare is going fab, apart from I forgot to do it today, so it's going comme ci, comme ça. Uh, and yes, I will see you in a couple of days' time with a brand new vlog. Stay tuned, all that fun stuff. Subscribe, do all that other things, and I'll see you soon. Night, God bless. Bye. I